Tianjin. I'm coming from Spain, but I'm coming from an office which is called RCI Architects. So the name of this office came from, from the name of the, of the three partners, Rafael, Carmen, and Ramon. And we started working together uh, since 1988. So in this image, we can see a, a model, a model of a, a lighthouse, the structure of a lighthouse. And it shows, in a way, very clear how we understand architecture. For us, architecture is a combination of the brief and the site. And to, for the brief, we try to understand the, the deepest concept of it. So for a lighthouse, we thought it was only a light, a fire beside the beach. But in this case, the place what was, wasn't a beach. It was a very um, a strong uh, mountain or strong um, um, rock. So we decided to, to put like a hand to hang the lamp. So for understanding maybe better our architecture, we have to say that we are working and living in a place which is called La Garrocha. It's the county of Olot, a city or a little town, a little village, uh, about 30,000 inhabitants. And the, the main purpose of this place is because we are in a natural park, in a volcanic natural park. So it's very important to understand the landscape that surrounds us and it has a very big influence to us in order to understand the landscape and architecture. So the landscape is quite soft and in the back we can see the Pyrenees. And here the natural is not um, a wild uh, natural, it's a very humanized natural. So when we see a natural landscape, we see a landscape made by nature and humans. We have this nice, for nice forest and we can see this landscape made by humans and nature with all of these terraces. And uh, for example, when we see the, the farmer houses, they can use for some hat, they use these tin plates coming from a, a, a metal, um, not bottles, but like a, a, a big pieces of metal. So they open it and they can cover, doesn't matter what. So uh, we are three partners, long time ago, we were more young. And now we are more than three and, and older. And we work in this space, which is an ancient foundry, that we try to keep the atmosphere that it had, and only putting the, the few things that we need for, for work, tables, and some shells.
maybe doesn't matter where, where we work. We work there because it's our, it's our city, it's our town. But we can show to you some, some tools, the tools that we use to work. So we use uh, different tools. That means we use, for example, uh, sketches. We try to, to make them in order to, to find the concept, the initial concept. And, and we draw it in order to keep it from the beginning till the end. So even if the process is, is something very long and very hard, we try always to keep the main concept. This concept we, we, we try to find a good balance between the program and the site. And then also we use some rendering, some 3D uh, images. And we use them in order to, to catch, to find the atmosphere that we like to have in the space. So each tool offers us a different kind of information. And then we use models too. Models in order to, 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 to know and, and to keep the main volume, the, 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 the most volumetric composition. So in this combination of the brief and the site, so then we as architects we say how to answer these two main questions. So in this case we can see an answer of this for a winery. So a winery is a place to produce wine <coughs> and it's a place it was so 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 powerful. So what we try to express, what we wanted to offer to the, to the people was this feeling to be underneath, to be covered by air. Only in this space you can you can feel the air and the rain if it is because it's open to the sky. And this is a, a house. And this house is in a very uh, wide field. 
and we wanted to to make a house that uh, it seems more an agricultural uh, construction, something for the for the field more than than house. So we, we try to to make these prints in the field like the prints could do uh, the water in a slope. On the other side, we can see this house as a rocks that cannot be erosioned by water or by the wind. You come to the house in a very hard way. The bullet seems that the water keeps there after a big rain. Raining views. <coughs> and this was a, a kindergarten. This kindergarten is seen very well because it is uh, in a very sloped street, so you can see the roof. So we try to make five facades and also to understand this as a, as a toy box was the pencil box. So children when uh, going down the street and they touch the building, there are some pieces that round when, when they touch them. So the building in a way reacts to them, plays to them, a place. This is a, a public space, a, a covered um, plasma yet. So it, it's in a, a small village close to a lot, and they wanted to have a covered plaza uh, in a place where before uh, there were a theatre, a theatre called the Lira. So we try to, to keep in a way the, the feeling of this stage. So right now when we are there you can feel maybe you are the actor or the actress of a, of a representation. So we try not to not to lose this feeling of the of the theatre. And also we decided to, to put this this bridge, this passarella crossing the, the river in order to make not the piazza as a cul de sac but a piazza that links two parts of the of the village, the more um, interior or ancient part to the more outside or soft part.
and then a house, a house in, a, in, a, in, the, in the town, in a road. So the facade was uh, protected, so then we can uh, put empty or to remove all the interior in order to make one, one space. So the house, it's made by different levels with any door, but uh, in the feeling you are in the same space, but in different places, in different uh, atmospheres. So for, for, from the brief, we try always to think about what is a house, what is the way that we live, and then for the side trying to to remark the, the potentiality of the of the site. Doesn't matter if it's a landscape or if it's an existing building, we treat them in the same in the same attitude. So, in order to understand how, when I'm saying, we try to go deeper in concept, we try to understand the grief, uh, this project shows, it's a project for the um, space of celebrations. So, we didn't want to make a, a very big a space. We, we have tried to, to think about the possibility to make a celebration like in a forest or like in a park. So, this, this picture uh, shows, uh, in a way, the inspiration to understand the concept of this kind of space. And in order to understand also the way that we have to, that we decided to build, it's, uh, for example, when a plaza is prepared for a, for a festival. So we try to, to, to make a, a something very, very light in order to, to prepare a an, an space for celebrations. So we go a little underneath because uh, the surroundings are so bad. So we remove a lot of stone and then we cut them and then this stone came back to the sun. These are the space for toilets. And then the air, the light, uh, makes you always a different perception of, of the space. Concept. 
not thinking about, we cannot um, take the things in a very immediate way, trying to rethink again about what things are or what the program are or what the program is. So, and then trying to understand the site, how we can be related to it with the site, with nature, with air. Not only when we say nature, it's not only a question of trees or green, but also of air to be connected to, to the sky in a way. So, in this understanding these two main items, then we decided how to, how to produce the space and we try to produce a space to, to provoke some feeling, some special perception, some special atmospheres to the people. So then everyone, each one has to, has its one feeling. <coughs> and now I want to, to leave to you with some images from a, a friend of us, Mark Szyski, who, who takes these nice pictures about the feeling he has on uh, our buildings. So what is nice is to see that we try to prepare a scenario for everyone can feel its own um, feeling. And all of this is made by a group of people. Thank you very much. <laughs> 